sprint reviews went really well. You can tell that the teams put in the hard yards to get stuff ready. Uh, there were uh, some really promising signs because they got entire pieces working. Yeah, so Sprint 1 was great. Uh, all the teams actually delivered value for the customer, for the product owner. So that, that was quite an achievement. Yeah, the first lot of Sprint reviews were really good. The guys are really getting a hang of it. We had great interactions with the product owner where we had the teams really clarifying their requirements and breaking things down really well. In preparation for the next planning meeting, we will uh, use that as an opportunity to discuss what sort of changes. Preparation wise, we were pretty good. We had a lot of great ideas, we had a lot of things to ask the product owner, and I suppose the days sort of maybe got away from us a bit, but you know, we, we, it, was, it was good, it could have been better, but yeah, I think the improvement's there, we're seeing it, so we're making progress. So our website at the moment is sort of like a template for them to apply, so we've sort of just tried to create something simple to start with. The sprint planning meeting was much better um, than last week's one. We've learnt a lot more since last week's one and applied that, so uh, overall uh, I feel like we performed better as a team. I managed to get their classes uh, for engineering framework. Uh, uh, sprint planning this time, I think uh, we're starting to get a bit more organised. Uh, we're still forgetting a few things and it is still new in terms of the time that it took us to uh, traverse through the items that we needed to get through in the sprint meeting was a lot quicker. All right, so that was good guys. I think we'll finish with Bob and we will, uh, give, I'll give you a little bit of feedback as to how you could make Bob um, have that as well. So even though the enthusiasm was high, a couple of the teams had the common problems. You know, they went down some rat holes, they forgot to ask the product owner to prioritise the backlog, you know, but they're learning and they're getting better. My highlights for the week were having uh, Paul Glavich out from Sasu talking about Angular and getting the guys all excited about that. Angular is something I'm very, very interested in and, and an example of just, a, you know, an emerging um, technology or framework and it's getting good traction. The feedback that we're getting and actually now that they're actually building the solutions and they're actually starting to deliver value every sprint, is just, I find that really exciting.